Hey guys, welcome to the ninth lesson on batch file scripting, and today I'll be teaching you about custom pauses. Now, custom pauses are actually known also as uh, a timed pauses, rehearsed pauses, but it's all just the same thing. What a custom pause does is it just allows you to pause your batch file for a certain amount of seconds. So this is this can come uh, in handy if you want to make your own animations or even the loading effect. So by the end of this lesson, you'll actually know how to make your own loading effect. So that when you open up your batch file, it, it would say loading. Then after three seconds, it would show a dot, and then another dot, and then another dot, and then it would just uh, say complete on the screen. So you'll be able to do that by the end of this lesson. So start off by setting up a basic batch file. I'm going to name this uh, custom pause. Okay, so let me just show you a simple um, a batch file with a custom pause in it. So echo, I'm going to say paused. And then here's how you actually pause. Ping localhost dash n and then the amount of seconds you want it to pause. So I'm going to make it pause for 3 seconds. And then the greater than sign and then null. So that's going to pause the batch file for 3 seconds. And then after the 3 seconds I'm going to make it say done pausing. And then I'm going to make it pause. Just a regular pause. Okay so let me save it as uh, loading.bat and let me select it all files and then let me just run it here it is let me run it and it doesn't work now I'll tell you why it doesn't work you actually have to run it as an administrator because the ping command it's actually considered an administrator command so just right click it run as administrator if it doesn't work as you can see it says pause and after three seconds it just said done pausing now if you didn't see that I'll run it again so it says pause and then it just said done pausing now let's actually learn how to do our own loading effect. So let me just change it, change all this to echo loading. So that's the first part of our animation. Echo loading, then ping localhost dash n three seconds. Or actually, I'm going to make it two seconds instead. I'm going to put null. Okay, so then let's clear the screen and put echo loading with one dot. And then let's put in the uh, loading or the pause command again, the custom pause command. So what this is going to do is it's going to say loading, then it's going to wait two seconds, then it's going to clear the screen, and then say loading with a dot, then it's going to uh, pause again for two seconds. So because if we didn't put in the uh, CLS command, it would say loading, and then it would, it, it would pause for two seconds, and right below it, below it, it would say loading with another dot, and that's not really an animation effect, so... It's it's gonna it's we're gonna actually uh, make it appear like it's adding a dot on to uh, the loading word. So uh, let's keep on going. Loading dot dot. Got the CLS command. So now it's gonna have two dots. Let's paste this again and then CLS loading, and then finally three dots. So let's make it pause for another uh, two seconds, and then let's make it uh, say complete. And then let, let's make it pause. And save your batch file. And run it again. Okay, so as you can see, it's loading. And then three dots. And the reason why this didn't work right here is because I never, I never put in the echo command right there. Let's save this again and run it. Okay, so it says loading. One dot, two dot, three dots. And then it just says complete. Press an equal to continue. That's what the pause command right here did. You press a key and it stops. So that's basically how you use a uh, custom pauses. So just change this to anything you want. So if I wanted to it to pause for 10 seconds, I'll just put in 10. Thanks for watching this lesson on custom pauses. If you have any trouble uh, with the custom pauses, please tell me and I'll get back to you as soon as possible. Don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next lesson.